All right, here's an analysis of Ty's um, 80 meter hurdle race. You gotta get a little more lean here. You notice right here, Ty is still bent over. We gotta get a body when she pushes off this toe. We need to get her body in more of a straight line. She's kind of bent over at the hips, which is you know kind of hindering her drive phase and push towards that first hurdle. She should actually look like this little kid here coming out. Get that good push, straight lean from the body, pushing off, off the toe. So we got a little arm swing while, which is causing her to not accelerate, you know, as she should to the hurdle. Looks better though. So let's go back in it. She's taking one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And on her eighth step, she's getting too close to the hurdle, which is causing her to have to jump. High in, high in the air over this hurdle. So if you look right here, Ty's clearing this hurdle way up in the air. She got that much space between her and the hurdle. But look, if she jumps, if she takes off further back, if she takes off further back, right there, she would be back down and quick back down on the ground, back in sprint form. Good recovery, but still too high, which is causing her to land instead of sprint. Arms. Once we get these, once we get these arms in, in good sprint form, keeping a the form, then she'll be able to drive better to the next hurdle. So we're getting three steps in, but because she came too far over the, I mean, you know, too far and not coming right down from attack, attacking the hurdle further off, she's get jammed up right here. She is able to. Take a three step, still having to get high because if she takes off here by taking off so close, she's having to gain height to clear the hurdle. Where we really want her trajectory to be here, so really her hip displacement only goes about maybe right there instead of so high. So we want a hip displacement to be lower. It should be about right there. Okay. She recovers and you know, bottom wise, some of slim, you know, decent recovery, but her arms. You know, by her arms flaring, it's twisting her body, causing her to have to overcorrect to get to the next hurdle. Three steps, but that causes her next to jam her up on this hurdle. And she's having to just jump it so she's still getting a whole lot of displacement above that hurdle so by her attacking the first hurdle real close it's causing her to jam up on the next hurdle come down get those arms she's still running good but then again we jammed up again so this first hurdle is causing us to get jammed up but looks a lot better. Recover, good recover, arm recovery there. Sprint form. Boom. Getting back down that ground. That's the one step hurdle drill is getting to, helping her recover real fast. Boom. And because she's a little tired, it's kind of falling into place for her where she's getting a takeoff where she should. Just got to fix those arms and everything kind of goes back into play. And she actually three steps all of them. We'll go back to the beginning of the race. Yeah. I heard a few of guys say they just drew. One, two, three. One, two, three. Keep your arms. One, two, three. 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 It's a big improvement. Big improvement.